What is going on, Phantom Army? Your boy Phantom Stilts, and welcome back to Observer. Hope you guys have enjoyed the series up to this point. Make sure to like and subscribe if you guys are brand new to the channel. That way, you guys don't miss any new Observer gameplay and Observer content as I upload to the channel. Without any further ado, we're going to jump right back into the game here. So, when we last left you guys, we had just come out of Helena uh, Novak's mine, and she's unfortunately deceased here on the floor. Um, so, we were investigating this tattoo parlor when we went inside her head. And uh, now, I believe, we're going to try to search this place. So let's go ahead and look at our uh, status here. So, Helena was running somewhere. I saw the code 3615 etched in her mind. It has to unlock something nearby. 3615 is the code. So, let's see. What's this? So, this is what we checked last episode. Uh, let's see, is there anything... That's the cash register that we looked at last episode. Turn on our electromagnetic stuff, see if we can find anything here. That's the hollow injector. Can we get through this door? Let's see if we can go back out and we go back into the courtyard. Oh, the door's locked. That's not good. What's this? Was a little bleak okay um let's see there's got to be some kind of computer that we can put that uh code into Find the hidden passage. So it's got to be... It's got to be through here, right? At least that's what I would assume. I wonder if it's under the chair, like if it's like an opening or something. There we go. Keypad. Three six one five, was it? Let's give it a shot. 
Okie dokie. So it was like a secret room. That's kind of weird. Another cash register that's not going to be much help to us. Okay, let's go this way. Surgical chop shop. Just what <laughs> Perfect, okay. Investigate some of the stuff on the table here. This place is a fucking slaughter. That's weird. Like there is a guy waiting for you in one of two eye prosthetics. Interesting. Alrighty. Let's see here. Oh, looks like there's something over here on the table. Encrypting station. Low power. Looks like there's some synchrosine over here. Synchrosine refilled. Well, looks like there's two things that I didn't uh, investigate over here. You look here. Looks dirty enough. Portable winch. Uh, that's to move that. Okay, what the hell is going on? Why is it growling? That was creepy as hell. Oh my god. Ooh, that scared me. I don't know why it scared me, but it scared me.
There we go. Okay, now I got it latched. Okay, cool. Now I can pull the grate up. And now we get to go inside the fun hole. Yay! Oh my god. Activate night. Now we have night vision. Okay. Oh, for God's sakes. This is not cool, man. Why do I... Why do I play these games, dude? I swear. What does it say? Iron is something. Oh my god. That's locked. So we have to go towards the floating chair. Fantastic. Anyone in there? I just want to talk. Oh, hello there. I'm Maria. I'm Dan. Hello, Maria. I'm Dan. Lovely name. Lovely. Now, is that short for Daniel? Like the one in the Bible? Dan, oh. N maybe. <laughs> Maria, I, I seem to have gotten lost down here. Could you point me to the nearest exit? Oh, yes, I understand completely. Completely. It really is a maze down here, don't you think? Yeah, it's very confusing. So, about the exit? All right. Go past. The noisy noises, and then straight ahead up the stairs, and there you go. Thank you. Just be careful. Don't stray from the path. You are a child of light, Daniel. Much too precious to get lost in the dark. Oh, uh, yeah. Thanks, uh, Maria. Past the noisy noises. This should be fun. Okay. Oh my god. Anifage was planned. Down in the dark. Need to skip town. Hey, don't panic, man. Think this through. If they knew where you were, why would they give you a head start? What if it's a trap? Maybe they're trying to flush you out, get you out in the open. You ask me, you should stay right the fuck where you are. Low. Lay low, JJ. They found me. They know I'm here. I'm sure of it. Found a dead bird outside my door earlier today. It's their calling card. Can't be a coincidence. I've already got in touch with someone who can get me out. He'll be here tomorrow. It's gonna cost me an arm and a leg, but fuck it. What other choice do I have? The buzzards don't forget, and they sure as hell don't forgive. Ari. Hey, got your message. Calling at short notice would be an understatement, but I think we can make it work. Gather your stuff and meet me tomorrow outside the building back alley near the old hotel. Come alone. I see more than one person in the deal's off. 6 a.m. sharp, don't be late, funnel. Okay. Alright. Somebody's been living in here. Okie dokie. Anything else in here that we can investigate? Anything else, anything else, anything else? Does not look like it, okay. Yeah, we can't open that door. Let's see if we can talk to somebody here. KPD, can I talk to you? What's up with the fucking lockdown? I want that thing lifted. Right the fuck now. Or what? Or what? You got a fucking death wish? 
wait till I get my hands on you. Sebastian, shut your fucking mouth. I just put the fucking kid to sleep. Don't be fucking disrespecting me, woman. I'll slap that shit right out of your mouth. You got lucky, pig. Gotta love the fucking stacks. Says the dude behind the locked door. Oh my god. Okay. Oh my gosh. Alrighty. What the hell? Hello, young man. I'm Dr. Landis. Do you know why you're here? You look like a big marshmallow. Ah, yes, the suit. I'm afraid it's necessary. Do you know why? Because you're scared of me. Okie dokie. Nothing else in here doesn't look like. Let's see. We go. We don't want to go boot it. We don't want to backtrack. We want to keep going forward. That door is locked. Look at our status here. The tunnel led me under the building. Need to find a way through the maze and get back to the upper floors. Maybe there's someone here who could help me. Find the source of the strange noises. That's the radio that we looked at, so let's go ahead and go back this way. That door's locked. That door's locked. That door's locked. Remove your implant. Why would I want to remove my implant, though? Love against Chiron. I think that's the woman I already talked to, okay? So, let's go this way. Fogginess, not good. I don't like it was this way. Ross is mushroom. KPD, I need to ask you some questions. You, you shouldn't be here. Calm down. It's all right. Like I said, I just want to ask you some questions. No, no, no questions. He'll think I'm flirting with you. Well, let me talk to him then. Please, just, just go away. He'll get mad if he hears us. Is he home or are you in danger? I'm gonna ask if she's in danger. Has he mistreated you in any way? Has he hurt you at all? You know, if we need to, we can take care of him right now. No, he's just... O overly protective. I I miss first, you know. Oh oh god. Oh god god. I shouldn't have told you that. You don't sound fine. Is this man home now? He's always home. He he's in the walls. Please just go, or we'll both be in trouble. Ma'am, I really don't want to leave him like this. It's all right. I am where I want to be. Wonderful. Aren't we having a mad fucking <laughs> party? That door's locked. That door's locked. That door's locked. Okay. So we can't get through that way. Uh, did we go this way? Yes, we did. Okay, so we're gonna go this way. Oh, 
What the hell are those sounds, dude? We already went that way, so we gotta go back. Hey! Anyone out there? Help me, please! What's wrong? What's going on in there? Oh, thank God. Please! I'm trapped in here. Okay, sir. Can you tell me exactly what's going on? I woke up stuck to this contraption. There was a tube down my throat. I barely managed to pull it out. Okay. Take a look around the room and tell me what you see. I can't see anything. There's something on my head. Oh, God, help me. Uh, remember what happened? The thing on your head. Let's ask about the thing on his head. Let's try this. The thing on your head, can you take it off? I... I'm not sure. I, I could barely lift my arms. God damn it, what have they done to me? Sir, listen to me. I want you to park your elbows on the chair, lower your head, and pull backwards. Uh, 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 thanks. I got it off. It's, uh... It's some kind of helmet. There's cables everywhere. There's a logo. Some kind of face with wings. The Morpheus VR series. Huh? The what? Hey, hey! Answer me! As captain of the Endeavor, a representative of the United Earth Initiative, I demand to know what's going on here! It was all on your head. <laughs> I hate to break it to you, sir, but there's no such thing as the United Earth Initiative. What? Do you know what a transfer is? No! Why should I? Someone who checks out, ditches reality, lives in a fantasy world. Well, why are you telling me this? You are in your apartment. You're not a captain. It was an illusion, sorry. The lockdown must have screwed up the transmission. You're experiencing atrophy, so you may have been sitting in the same chair for months. Shut up! You're lying! I don't know what game you're playing, mate, but I do know my crew is already looking for me. Right, whatever you say. I wasn't trained for this. Wait! Don't leave me in here, you bastard! I, I gotta get out of this hellhole! Reality, pal. Reboot and flip back. It's the best we got. 